it turns out that the CPU and the GPU are rather far apart. There's a lot of distance between them. It's imperceivable to, to a human, but in computer time, right, it takes almost an eternity in order to get information between the two. So every command that we send is going to take an eternity to get to the GPU. Nothing for us, but when your goal is to render 16 million pixels 60 times a second, even, even a tiny bit of time starts to add up, right? So the idea with like Vulkan and DirectX and Metal is that we want to pool all of our commands together. We want to make like buffers, as they call it, of our commands, and then try and send them all at once. OpenGL is all about manipulating some sort of state. So, so you set the state of the GPU. Turns out that that's quite a bit slower, but you can also get a default state. So it's quite a bit easier to get something up and running. 